Hey guys, what's going on? It's Simon here and welcome back from Rootshag's Minecraft Adventures, episode number 84 and I have been hard at work down in the depths of the vault. Well, not quite the vault, we're not on the vault yet, but I'm in the little wing of the back room and oh my god, I've probably gone a little overboard. Look how wide this room is. I haven't even dug back like the full way. Um, I'm expecting this to go like much further back, so lots more stuff to be removed and yeah, it's, it's, it's kind of crazy. It is kind of crazy. I've probably gone a little bit too overboard, but hey... If we're going to do it, we may as well do it absolutely mental. So, yeah, I'm pretty happy with it. So, uh, I asked you guys in the last video, what should I sort of do with with the chest? How should I rain the chest and stuff like that? Had some uh, pretty good suggestions. And one of them, even though it's not actually, you can't actually see it here. Oh, oh no, shit. My hatchet just broke. Oh, God. What are the chances? Stupid iron axe. I need to go. Oh, should I make a diamond one? I don't really have the diamonds to make one. Oh, I've got to punch these things. Actually, no, the pickaxe has got efficiency. That'll break it faster, even though it's a pickaxe. Right, um, uh, so what you guys basically advised me to do was uh, I, c I said I couldn't have them, like, more than four high because or more than three high because otherwise I couldn't open them. You just said, well, why don't you just make a little little hole so I can kind of... You see, I've got this little chimney. It's almost like a, yeah, a little chimney chimney breast section, and I can just put it with chests all the way to the top like that, and then you've got four, four double chests, and you can access that top one, and it doesn't exactly... Uh, look particularly bad at all. Looks pretty like groovy. In fact, just having that little uh, hollow bit at the top. Maybe you could fill that with glowstone or some kind of light. That would look quite cool. Um, I wonder if that'd work. Actually, would that light down the whole way, or would it just get blocked off by the chest? Because I know the chest's got a little bit of a uh, sort of see-through strip. But I don't know whether that actually lets light through or not. Hmm. That'd be quite intriguing to find out, actually. Um, but yeah, I'm thinking all the way to the roof, uh, chest like that. And the reason being is just uh, I don't know. I think. You're going to want to have to store a lot of stuff. So you got like dirt, things like that. I've already filled a chest and we've barely done anything on this map yet. So uh, I honestly think that uh, we're going to need a lot of chests. And I think this will be a cool way to do it. So you can see I've like I've laid out a few areas of how, how I think it's going to look. Um, and I've sort of mirrored it on this side a little bit. I've still got quite a lot to do actually. Like um, I, th I think over here I've still got to dig out some of the the wall because as you see I had uh, brick all in there I need to fill this all in with brick and get this all looking uh, proper and nice it's, uh, I think it's just stone brick in all the places that are visible so we'll just do the trick oh, had some cobblestone fall in there and there we go I think that's pretty much exactly the same as that it's looking really funky and here we go with the uh, with the double chests um, now one thing I did ask you guys about was the fact that I was saying like how should I sort of signify that it, it contains dirt? And I was thinking signs, um, but as you guys said, like you can't really do signs well with a double chest. So uh, the best thing that I decided to do was literally just to go for the whole sort of uh, two little things in there. Say if this was cobblestone, would make it easy. There you go. I just put cobblestone literally like that, and then you can see uh, we've got cobblestone in that chest. It'd be pretty obvious uh, running around. You have like cobblestone dirt, then you have like, like a, a lapis lazuli block and stuff like that. Um, so it's all going to be very nice. I've got two laid out here because I, I want to. It's kind of weird because I've made it so wide this room. I want to have like a little um, central area as well. So this will go all the way up to the roof. I might as well put that in now. Why not? Why not? Uh, I was thinking if I get it like this, uh, all the way up to the roof. That's the plan. Um, and last one. Okay, so if that went all the way up to the roof, um, obviously, actually, that was a bad idea. Because um, it would have these bits filled in, I'd imagine. Because um, I now want to dig this out. And you'd have chests like in there. So you could have, like when you walk in, you've got uh, two rows of chests um, as well. And then obviously there'd be chests on this side as this like runs down into the room. It'd be kind of crazy. It would be kind of crazy. Um, but I, I think it's going to look freaking awesome. Uh, so I need to start sort of digging out around here. Make sure I have all of these symmetrical, looking all right, and making sure it's only stone brick showing. That's what we want. Stone brick is the stuff that looks friggin' awesome. I think these little side blocks are visible, so uh, need to get stone brick in there and stone brick here. Oh god, ran out. Still got four stacks on me. I love the way because I've gone so extravagant in this room. It just means that um, oh crap, maybe I had to go a bit higher than that. Oh god, two more. Wow. It's going to take so much stone brick. So, yeah, making the room really big obviously just means I have to make a lot more stone brick. Um, but I do means I get more cobblestones. It's not a bad thing. It's a kind of a one-for-one -one transaction going on here. But it just means it takes time. 
I don't know. If we're going to make it, may as well make it good. So here we go. Let's fill this up with chests. Sweet. Okay, so we've got it on both sides now, looking groovy. All right, let's uh, have a look at doing it over here. Got to do it over here. Right, go up by two. And I think it's by two. Is there going to be enough? Yeah, that's got enough. Uh, obviously, I just need enough space so that the, uh, the the top chest can indeed open. And then I can uh, dig all of this out um, and fill it with the whole the old stone brick. Looking friggin' awesome. Oh, God. Shovel. So this shovel's nearly gone as well. Look at it. Um, I thought this had unbreaking on. Oh, it does, but it's only unbreaking one. Um, so that's not particularly great. I probably should, if I'm going to be destroying chests, I probably should go and make myself an axe. Uh, that's what I should probably go and do. Um, I guess I have gave myself a lot of resources being down here, so um, I could go and deposit them in the chest. Although, saying that, I've now got these chests here. I could just use these and store some stuff. So, say if this was cobblestone. Um, actually, to be fair, cobblestone's like a, something you dig up really easily, so you'd want it on the way in. So, you maybe have these two as uh, as cobblestone, or at least these two as cobblestone. All right, let's... Uh, or would you have these two maybe as like random junk, so the unsorted stuff? Because sometimes you might run in off a, off a quick like cave raid and uh, don't have time to sort it all out. So perhaps um, that would be like a, a quick sort thing. Okay, we'll say these are cobblestone. I could just for now at least throw uh, some cobblestone here. And uh, that's six blocks. I've only got any more full stacks. Okay, we got rid of that. That's quite nice. Um, just trying to think now. I've got to dig all these up to the roof. Um, let me just look at it. Wow, I've got to dig out so much, like you see it. Hopefully there's no, I don't dig into water or lava or something even worse. Um, but I do have to dig out quite a lot because you've got to have uh, the the blocks so that you can uh, have the blocks at the top so that the, the, the top chest can open and uh, you can get all of your goodies out. I think that's it. I think that's how it look. Must put those chests in. I'm gonna run out of chests. I've made 64 chests, thinking, "Oh yeah." Even though it cost loads of wood, I was like, "I'm not gonna run out now." And now I'm using eight chests per little tower that I do. Oh god, this is bad. This is bad times. All right. Well, I might as well use up. Um, I've kind of even laid out three here almost. Or what I'll do. Now oh, I've got one over here that I haven't done. Did I put? The, have I made all this? I made it all look good. I just didn't put the chests in. What was I thinking? All right. Okay. Like breaking crazy. It's crazy awesome. Right, and uh, do I need to dig out that one? No, I don't think so. What I'll do is I'll just uh, brick in. Oh yeah, I've got to do the back so you can actually, when you see through the little gaps, you don't see. Uh, so that's the thing. Like I could just leave it as stone, but you can see through the little gaps uh, down the side as well of the chest. And I don't know. I just want everything looking perfect, absolutely flawless. Uh, let's get these side blocks gone. And those two have to go as well, and then we're good. Uh, I don't know whether I have to jump to do that. It's pretty high up. Right, and here we go. Now there's loads of suggestions about different like combinations I could use, or like different setups I could use to make my chest look cool. But I don't know. I, I just want to go for something simplistic, and I like the whole recessed into the wall nature of this. It's like all flush. It's nice. Um, in the, like, I was thinking, yeah, signs kind of do look a bit messy sometimes because it's just like. Uh, when it's next to a chest, it's like pretty obvious sometimes if you just have a block instead. Uh, to make it all simple, very easy to use. Um, definitely like the sound of that as a whole. So let's quickly um, finish this one and then I can go uh, back to probably the house and get myself another stone axe, I'd imagine. Not stone axe, iron axe at least. Or should I step up to the diamond? I got diamond of everything else, but the problem is I only made a diamond shovel because it was uh, it's cheap to make. It's only one diamond. I've only got six. Don't really want to be wasting them all. Right, uh, well they're saying that, what else am I going to use them on, so it could just as well be worth it. Alright, here we go, just get it all the way down here, holy shit, you burn through this stuff so fast. Um, do I need to, I don't think I needed to dig that stuff out of the bottom, no problem, I can fill it back in. Okay, and the final row of chests, where's it going, oh, there we go. Oh yes, yeah, so that's looking pretty funky, not going to lie. Pretty impressed with that stuff. Um, I've tried to make this so this will line up. So you'd have, obviously, chests here. If I dig this out. God, man, look at this pickaxe. It's gone down so fast just because it's only efficiency rather than and breaking as well. Um, so, yeah, you'd have uh, another thing here. Uh, let's get into the stack out. Holy crap, burning through the stuff. So you'd have uh, uh, one chest like recessed in there, maybe. 
or would you have it an extra one? I don't know, because it's like, I've kind of gone for the, the two chests, one brick, two chests, one brick, all the way around. Um, so you kind of want just to have the one brick on each end. Um, I guess that's not a problem. And uh, obviously this is actually going to leave. Oh, oh my god, oh, my, amazing idea. Oh yes, amazing idea. Oh god, this is going to be awesome. Um, so if I'm... Hold on, let me just dig out some of this so I can... Oh god, I dug out the roof. Actually, that's not a bad thing. I need to get the roof. Got to fill it with a stone brick. Uh, yeah, I just had an awesome idea. Oh yes, it's freaking cool. Oh god, oh god, is that a cave? That's a cave. This is where the freaking spider noises and all craziness have come in, haven't they? Holy... Oh god, that's... um, That's Netherlink Station, isn't it? This is where... Oh no! Why? This cave's freaking massive as well. This is exactly where I want to dig. We've got problems, people. Uh-oh. Oh, no, I might have to cut it short. I can't cut it short. Oh, God. If I cut it short, it just ruins it. Let's get the torch up here, because it's dark. I don't want any mobs spawning. Oh, I can already see a peeny bee down there. Oh, there's iron and coal, though. What? Why is this torched up and we left iron and coal? What kind of amateurs were we when we raided this thing? Um, let's uh, just get rid of all of this. Pick it up. Yes. And the coal we desperately need. We have a zero coal. Can't even smelt the iron that we've got. Where did it, where did it go? There it is. There's the coal. Alright, let's get this freaking window. Right, and get in all the coal. And where it's oh my god, this is a pretty pretty nice vein. Oh yes, and it goes on, it goes on and on and on. Let's uh, mine all of this out. God, it's got really dark up here now. I think that'll be it. Yeah, that is it. I'll just put a torch there then. No problem. And what? How much coal do we get from that? 17? Oh yes, I'm up to 10 iron. Not a bad effort. Um, there is a bit of cobblestone here. That is intriguing. Is that because there was probably just a bit of water flow maybe? And I blocked it off? Probably that. I should really stop using cobblestone. I got really excited and thinking it might be a uh, a dungeon. Aww. Oh well. Uh, it's definitely dark around here. Oh, what the? Why? Hold on. Why is there a chicken? down here. Chicken? How, how did you, how did you even get down here? Holy shit! You're not a chicken! No you don't! Back off! Oh my god, he's... Tr chicken, dude! Look what you nearly did to me! You nearly got me killed! Where did you come from? Is there like some quick route to the surface that you fell down? Well, you clearly lost, so... Uh, I can't even hit you now. Die! There we go. Oh yes, I could do with those feathers. Feathers are awesome! Okay, right, so, um, after I've killed that, oh, that got me one level as well, after killing that peony bee. Uh, I was thinking, that means I can go make my axe, oh, yes, hello, coal, uh, before I do that, then I'll get up all the coal, uh, and then I need to get back to beast and make the axe, right, holy crap, we've got a lot of coal, that's awesome, it builds it so fast, 33, it's really dark down here, does that mean we haven't explored, or is it just, I didn't torch it? Oh, it's a dead end and I just didn't torch it. Oh well, found more coal. Holy shit, where'd that come from? Skeleton noises. That's not good. Um, oh, it's going down really far. Okay. Oh, that's it, that's it. Oh, sad. Wanted more coal from that, but oh well, let's head out. Right. To get out of here is going to think be a bit of a problem. I've got to remember where I, uh, <laughs> where I came in. Oh my god, this is a nightmare. Did I go all the way around here? This seems remotely familiar. Yeah, I jumped over there. Aha, it should be up here then. Um, oh, God, I'm so disappointed that we came out into this cave. It's just... Wow, there's a lot of coal up there as well. Here we go. This is where we came out. Um, all right, so what I'll do, I'll... Uh, actually, is, is it a quicker route for me to... Uh, <laughs> this is... I was going to run all the way up the bank vault stairs. I'm saying, is it quicker for me to just hop out of the, uh, the Netherlink station? That would be quite amusing if it was. Right, here we go. Oh, this place looks so freaking cool. Another brick in the wood. The lava grid thing. Ooh. Is this getting daytime or getting nighttime? I think it's it's getting lighter. Oh, yes. Comes out in a new dawn. Freaking awesome. All right. Well, uh, I'm going to head back to base. There's a zombie there, but I can sprint past it. Skeleton there, I'll sprint past it. Oh, they're all going to burn up at nighttime anyway. And hopefully... I get in here um, now. Now I've got to make the big decision. Do I uh, do I just go for an iron axe? I think I will. I won't waste diamonds. Um, let's just go for iron because I don't know. An axe isn't something I use too often anyway, so I don't think it's too much of a 
a problem. Right, so let's get the other uh, two sticks. Three iron on the go, and come on, all right, screw this, uh, using 12 levels to get a, un it wasn't even, wasn't even unbreaking, it was efficiency one. Let's see what I can get just off a of one prodding. Oh, which one are we going to go for? Ooh, I don't know. That's got two, so I'm going to go for it. Efficiency one. See, look at that. Exactly the same enchantment. One level was a third, it might have been 13, I think it was 12, though. 12 on that diamond pickaxe. Freaking scam. Oh, well. Uh, that will last for quite a while. And uh, actually, I need this shovel still. Um, but yeah, <laughs> what a scam. I can't believe that. I'm never going to get over that, am I? Just <laughs> wasting 12 levels on that piece of crap. Not that it matters, because as soon as James comes back, I would have lost those levels anyway, because he would have killed me in some ridiculous stunt. Um, and that's not even being <laughs> assumptive. That would just would have happened. Anyway, guys, what I think I'll do is I'll uh, wrap it up there um, for today's episode. Clearly, um, been working like an absolute trooper down. Oh, shit! No, you don't. Been working like a trooper down in the uh, the vault until this PNB tries to come and ruin the day with this crazy, crazy mouth. Uh, let's get in. There we go. And uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to head down. I'm going to extend that further back so I can uh, go ahead and make sure we extend it further in and get loads and loads of chests down there. It's going to be freaking awesome. Uh, I will need to go up at some point, get more wood, and obviously actually get some more resources to put in the chest. But for now, I think it's looking freaking awesome. All right, guys, well, thanks for watching, and I'll see you again tomorrow.